Hey, good morning everybody. Happy Fired Up Friday! We made it. Just got done with my workout. 4.30 a.m. workout. Got some cardio in. Uh, got a little bit of shoulders going on, but I hope you have an amazing Friday. So, 4.30 a.m. workout. We got rocking and rolling. I'm going to take you through my vlog throughout the day today. Got a very, very busy day today, but we will see you tonight. Uh, we will be posting this around 7, 7.30. We got a lot of things to accomplish today. I hope you have a great Fired Up Friday today, and don't forget to listen to the podcast up here for free daily motivation. Love you guys. Talk to you in just a moment. What's up everybody? Hey, it's 9 o'clock now. The project I am working on uh, in the studio is the finishing up the editing of the Royds to Riches book, The Fall and Rise of a Spiritual Man. I'll be working on that for the next couple hours. Editing needs to be done. Uh, we're coming up on the deadline and that book should be out in about 10 days. Also working on my project and my PowerPoint uh, so that I can bring you the You Must Believe Way of Life seminar uh, in person and webinars as well where I can teach you step by step um, how to accomplish any goal you put your mind to. All right, guys, we'll check in a little bit later. Hey, what's Thank up, you. everybody? It's 11.45 right now. Quick update. Uh, still editing the book, Roids to Riches, Fall and Rise of a Spiritual Man. I uh, got a lot of editing to do, but I want to get this out as quick as possible and out to the world. It's my biography, John Vasquez, of the rise and fall, or the fall and rise of a spiritual man, but still editing that. But here's the beauty of taking control of your life, guys. I just had lunch with little JJV and JJV. JJV, say what's up. He's not in the mood. But anyways, hey, I took control of my life. I took charge of my life. I'm my own boss now, and I get to go inspire the world to show them the power they have inside them and do great things. I want to give you a little update. I'm going to go hit the streets in just a moment. We'll talk to you in a bit. Thanks, Hey, guys. what's up, everybody? It's about 4.30 in the afternoon. Uh, the day got completely thrown upside down, as it always does in business. Uh, you got to be adaptable. You got to be flexible. I meant to go hit the streets, but the editing has been taking a long time. But my goal is to get this book done and ready to go uh, within the next 15 days so I can get it out to you guys and have a book launch party. So been a lot of days uh, time editing right now. I want to let you guys know right now If you look we got the pictures here and working to get them to the publisher so that we can get these into the book So it's a last-minute change. Uh, we'd like to have some pictures for the book to make it a little bit more uh, Engaging but last-minute change see if we can do it. We're gonna try to make it happen So at Staples, I don't think you can see the sign But at Staples right now gonna get the picture scanned and get these over to the publisher talk to you in a Hey, bit. what's up guys? Happy Friday evening. We made it. We made it want to come to you with an ending message here uh, for the vlog on Friday Fired Up Friday. I want to thank you guys for going on the whole journey with me today. Uh, it's been an awesome, awesome day. So we're going to talk about the lesson of the day for small business owners, anybody trying to build a brand, or anybody wanting to leave their corporate America job to venture out on their own. I'm going to share with you trials, tribulations, and also the great successes of owning your own business. But want to talk about the week first. Number one, the week was absolutely fantastic. Oh my gosh, what a fun week of being full-time at JV Impacts. I had a ton of success um, consultations this week. I have two lined up for next week, which is awesome. And I think I told you guys that it's transitioning more to the body transformation, uh, really the mind and body, which is awesome. So I used to be in the uh, personal training industry, uh, but a lot of people approaching me for the body transformation. But you know, I'm gonna get you from the inside and we're gonna get it to the outside eventually. So, you know, I can help you with success coaching, I can help you with uh, goal setting, I can help you with uh, weight loss, I can help with anything you put your mind to, I can help you with. Also, we had our amazing interview with Joseph Rebel that went absolutely phenomenal. Thank you all for your support. Uh, he is the director, uh, let's see, get his, get his, let's get his title right, Director of Athlete Development at Twisted Gear and Adaptive, and uh, that's awesome. They'll be at the Olympia next weekend. So we got some other special guests coming up in the next couple weeks, which will be phenomenal. But today was all about getting the Roids to Riches, The Fall and Rise of a Spiritual Man, my biography coming out, and you're gonna hear the real story that really happened 11 years ago. And you can see brick by brick how I built my life back together. But the story is personal, it's very intimate, and it's designed to help a lot of people with a lot of hidden issues out there. I wanna bring it to the surface, I'm gonna be open, transparent, and I'm gonna travel the world helping people see that they have the power inside of them to get over any circumstance that they're in. And that's my job, and that's my mission. So. Let's talk about the lesson today in small business, or if you want to leave corporate America, start your own business, or if you're in corporate America, right? As a small business owner, one thing you need to be is adaptable. You need to be adapting to change at all times. So every single day, I'm always, always journaling. So I'm always journaling. I write my day down every single day. I'm not sure if you can actually see the writing there, but I write down my day, who I'm going to call, who I've talked to, uh, what was the effectiveness around that for my conversation, how can I add value to that person. I write down how I feel. I write down my goals, and I write down pretty much everything that happened throughout the day, kind of like a vlog, but on paper. Uh, so that's very, very important. But I plan my day the day before. So my lesson today is about adaptability, right? I went into today. I had a plan to uh, get the edit 
editing done, uh, get that up to back up to my uh, publisher and editor and get that, all that stuff knocked out. Well, guess what? That was supposed to be done by 11 o'clock. I was supposed to be hitting the streets by 12. I was supposed to be out there doing some marketing and some uh, relationship meetings. Well, the day got completely thrown upside down, guys. The editing has taken forever. There's tons of edits that I want to do. We might be adding some additional pictures in there or some pictures, excuse me. Uh, so I had to go use a scanner, had to do all kinds of stuff and use a saw. My whole day got transformed. But what I did was every opportunity I got to get in the car and drive somewhere to take care of the editing or the scanning of pictures, I made a phone call. So I used that to have meetings. So I had about four meetings today via phone. I just changed my direction. Instead of physically going to meet people, I just made the phone call. So I didn't make excuses. I made adjustments to my plan. So one thing you got to be when you're a business owner or building your own brand or going out on your own is you have to be adaptable. So don't let your day completely catch you off guard and screw you all up. Just get right back on track, find ways to make it happen. And if it doesn't happen today, put it on your list for the next day. So short, fun messages out there. Uh, if you're bored tonight or if you want to get motivated before you go out tonight, or go out on a date tonight, listen to the podcast. It's right up there. It's prosperity versus poverty mindset. Very, very important. But I want to uh, say thank you before I leave the podcast uh, for the amazing, amazing podcast downloads. And we just hit the UK. We just hit South Africa a couple hours ago. So we're in South Africa, UK, we're in Mexico, we're in Spain, and we're all over the United States. So I want to say thank you. I love you, and I hope you have an amazing, amazing amazing evening excuse me don't forget to leave comments or any feedback anything you'd like to hear on the podcast i'd love to hear your feedback we'll talk to you soon guys love you